said we were gonna make another sixty Sure got chilly all of a sudden, eh? Good morning everybody we are back at her again I got the steel all picked up yesterday uh, it's all on the trailer there ready to go and we are gonna tackle the roof still only got one side here ready to go that uh, is ice free well almost I'll chip the rest of it off whatever's left will chip off yet and uh, then we'll get at her so I'm gonna take these dishes off we're only using the one there's two satellite dishes up there I got the one unbolted already uh, right there and the other one here is for our internet, so I'll take it off, but I gotta put it back on again because we obviously need internet uh, just to even show you this. But um, yeah, we'll get at it. We're getting some stuff ready to go. The boys are finding uh, all the tools we need, impacts and stuff. And Waylon was busy hauling over some strapping he's got laying over here now. And uh, yeah, I gotta cut the shingles off. The way I like to do it, I cut the shingles off the edge of the roof. Uh, the, all the stuff that hangs over, the rest stays, and then I put my strapping over top and put the steel on. So, we'll get at her. That's what I was talking about here. So this stuff needs to come off. Everything that hangs over needs to come back to, uh, to about that point. And then I have a new trim that's coming that's going to hang over top of this. Plus the strapping that I'll put on, and then the steel goes over, and then it's all nice, nice seal. So we're gonna get that all cleaned up, and then that's that patch of ice. It's not real big; most of the roof's clean, but unfortunately, the other side of the roof hasn't melted off yet. And I don't know if it even will. Well, it's better than it was. Who knows? Today's supposed to be pretty nice. Maybe it will actually melt off yet. It's just I don't want to go through all the effort. The loose stuff's not bad, but there is some chunks of ice on there that would be harder to take off, especially down below. That's actually our front door there. So every time we open up the door, I think a lot of the heat comes out and it kind of melted the snow above there. There's actually quite a chunk of ice right on the edge. So, but no, it actually looks better than I thought it would. Yesterday there was still quite a bit on here. So today is going to be above zero. Tomorrow will be above zero. And we'll get that done. It's a unique view of the property you don't see every day. That's the shop roof. So this is the side that we did already a couple months back. Now we're going to do that side and the lower slopes, two pieces. Those are the chicken runs that we built. Or bird runs, not just chickens. Oh, there's our backyard. And then the barn over there. Yeah, nice little view. Anyways, I can't just show you this all day. I got to get some work done too.
All right, battery died. These things happen. We, uh, I got all the trims cut off, or all, not the trims. I got all the shingle edges cut off on that side. We're just gonna work on the south side of the roof for now. We'll let this melt some more. I think with a good broom, we'll get most of that off, other than maybe the chunk of ice down there, but we'll see. It'll take us a while to get this done. So what I'm doing now is I'm gonna lay these strappings on uh, all the way along the edge. You can see where I caught it now. The white is exposed. That's from the starter trim here from the shingles and so the trim that I've got bent up will just go right over top of that I'll show you that later but we're gonna run strapping all the way down like this all the way along the edge down well, obviously not where it's laying but right right tight to the edge and all the way along the bottom and then we'll measure up every two feet we'll put another piece of strapping we'll run one strapping every two feet all the way up and uh, then we'll get ready for the steel. So I gotta make sure those stay straight. I like to pre-drill my steel. Uh, I just did another video there, not that long ago where I showed you that. But um, yeah, we like to pre-drill it all and then it's ready to go. So make sure all the strapping stays straight and we'll get this whole side strapped on. And uh, then I gotta put the trims on and then we're ready for steel. Coming up, Wayne? Yeah. Got my two boys helping me today. The oldest boy used to help me lots with this, but uh, he's moved out, so he's, got, he's busy enough. So now you're a big helper, right? Can you even see through there? Yeah. Oh, God. What are you going to do today? Help. Help with what? Stick this wood on. Perfect. Have you been up on the roof before? No. Is it your very first time? No. Is it scary? Yeah? Yeah, you'll be alright though. You stay away from the edge, okay? All right, let's get at her.
his first time on the roof. He's doing a really good job. We always let the uh, the kids on their first couple times on the roof, they just get to go up there and kind of sit on the, the peak. And then they kind of get used to the idea of being up there and you don't have to worry about them falling over the edge. And then they get like this guy at 10 years old. He's a good worker.